Right, okay, give me a moment. I'm just slightly behind again. I'm good. It's going to be like this for the next couple of weeks. Um, just because I'm having to do a bit extra around the house. Um, because <clears throat> my other half is still a bit on well, so need to get that sorted, unfortunately. But it should be done, and uh, she should be well enough to, do, to help. Uh, well, it's just to go right back to normal in the next couple of weeks. Alright, okay, let me just do this. Right. Okay, so we're going to start in a moment. First of all, I decided we're going to do a bit of a kind of hardware stream, which is why this is on here. Um, we have an upgrade to do on the 486, so I might as well get that out of the way first. Um, I've just had to fiddle around with the Amiga. Uh, that's the other reason why I'm late as well. Um, I'll talk about that later. Uh, okay, so OSSC over here. Just kind of shift. Right, let me just unplug it a moment. I don't know why I still had it on. On. Um, okay, this needs to go here. This needs to come out, and I'll test the Amiga later after the stream. As long as I don't fall asleep again like I did last time. Um, and let's close it. And this can go over here because the box is empty. Right, so what I need to do is I need to pull out the um the the me um the four eight six. So you have to give me a sec. Over here. Right, so the first thing I'm going to do is to take off the CD ROM because it's sat on the thing. Oops, I need to unplug it as well. to remember not to pull the cable the CD run thing is on. Just because it's so long it's kind of underneath the table. to massively go into the back I just need to do enough so that I can see the memory oh shit I forgot to do something I need to double check whether I can do 316s otherwise it's going to be pointless me doing this just double check that I can do 360s I'm pretty sure I can Where's the documents? Right, six PC. The service guide. That service guy doesn't know, I think it's the other one. There we go. 
Where's computer memory configurations? Yeah, 16, 16, 16. Oh. Okay. So can, I've got two fours and two for sixteens. But once the sixteens come in, I have to take out one of the fours. So it won't do fifty two. Well I'll put another rate right meg in. So I suppose that's something. Right, that's fine. Uh, I'm only adding another few bits and that's okay. I can deal with it. over here so you can see you might not want to see much right that's the memory modules this a bit more now um, in fact I will increase the second cam so you can see what I'm doing right okay so what we're doing is we're going into here so we've already got two 16s you won't be able to see this properly um, I've got four there, so I just need to unclip that four. In fact, I need to unclip both of the fours to be fair. That's the that's the first four out. the second one out now, where did I put the there it is hopefully this will work mm -mm.
Let's see the moon side, not on the other. The irony is I'd love to have my um my webcam but just a phone just to get the uh the light in here. But I can't. That's fine. Let's do it that way. <laughs> I don't get the light from the monitor. How did I get these in last time? Pretty sure it was this way. Was it? No. Circuit. That's clicked in. Right, okay. Moment of truth. stuff in uh, the thumb screws I've got here or drop them like I usually do with the Mega ones and the difference is still on the desk not under it apologies for breathing and on the camera not the camera the <laughs> the microphone Start pushing this back. Got the cord in. Not pushing too far back enough to get yeah, okay. Right. CV ROM. Day. That's that. That in should be pretty much everything. Right, so finish setting up. So VGA to the splitter. That's in. Uh, so VGA to the splitter. Need to reconnect this, which is the USSC.
Move my earphones out the way. Put the other side of the VGA in. That's that. Alright, that's those. I don't need a splitter because I've already got one small I need. Now it's the USB cable. Straight to that. Uh, and then I need to put the sound from the sound card in. A bit easier than the um, the Amiga setup. Just give me a moment, I'll be back in a sec. Right, I'm back. Apologies for that. Okay, so I've got everything pretty much, pretty much set up, I think. So, let me just hopefully push this back. Turn this off because we don't need that now. And then we can go. This is still okay, right? Okay, so if I go click. And this should go into action. If it doesn't, that's not a problem. Deactivate and reactivate the video. Jump. Push this out. Realm. Okay. So, um, I think we're pretty much ready then. Click this on. Where is the let's see.
Well, I'm not getting anything in the monitor, and usually that means uh, something didn't like something. Did it not like the memory? Maybe I should have installed the RAM beforehand or after. Shit. I do hate it when this happens. I think oh, I know. I'll be cool. Installed the uh, new stuff on uh, stream, and then something goes wrong. Really should um, listen to myself. Well, I say listen to myself, just not do stuff like. That. Maybe if I take off the VJ splitter, let's see if that'll help. No, it still doesn't like it. Maybe I just need to take out their memory. Fucking annoying. I hope it's not because it's new memory, it just doesn't like the idea of it. not unusual and not happening before. I've just inserted memory, now it doesn't like the entire thing. That's stupid. Well, 
way to go for ruining my dear the tentacle there. Stream or oh, my own stream, sorry. I'm such an idiot. Should be fine with the memory in there. Yeah, you just put in because it's fine usually with one sixteen. That's 16 back in again. Maybe it just needs to be put in a second time. Apologies for those of you watching and wondering what the hell I'm doing again. Um, basically, I just thought it'd be easier to install 16 meg module that I got recently from eBay. Because it's not like I've not installed stuff on this before and it's worked. Because it has worked, it's been fine. It's just this time it decided to be shit. And then we go, oh no, I don't like the fact you've got memory in there now. I'm like, yeah, thanks. Just show all the supporters how inept I am. I'll put in memory a standard machine that you should be okay with. It's not like I don't have two blocks of 16 in already. That's the me memory's bad, which is also a possibility.
Oh, unless I've got to report everything back in again. Sorry. All right, you can go there. Tell you what, uh, let me put the um, air cam two on again. <coughs> so at least you can see what I'm doing, just about. looks in there quite nicely this one is same Yeah, the fun part of when you're trying to get the memory in it's a bit cock-sided. fact, let's just see what this does. No, actually, I can't do two fours, can I? I do. No, actually, I should be able to do it. Oh, no. One so it should be okay. Oh, come on. This is fucking ridiculous.
tell you what, let me push this one back and then I can push this one in that makes sense deal with that later. Right. Finally get back to the other tentacle and I'll sort the uh, grade out later. I was being an idiot. Okay. Uh, apologies for that folks. I've done it again. When I think, oh, I know, I'll just put in uh, a hardware upgrade while I'm here. Be cool for everybody to see, but no, of course it isn't. Um, earphones. Alive for 39 minutes and got nowhere. <laughs> okay. Right, let's try this again, shall we? Look, I can pick it up quite easily. Where have we gone? It's 6281. Uh, 4670. So I need one of these. And I also need four of this one. And I need not quite four here. Wrong. Ready. So I what I did on Friday was I went and I played this um a little more after the stream just so that I can kind of remember where I was. Um, do we still have... Right, okay, so we need to get this fixed. Um, how do 
get Edison outside. Not Edison, um, Brent Franklin. Can't remember now, so let's go back to this. One thing I completely forgot about. This is quite easy to get Edna out of here. What we need to do is we need to go click push, wait until she comes back over, and then just kick her out. Well, you know what they say. If you want to save the world, you've got to push a few old ladies down the stairs. Right, now what we need to do is we need to use the uh, videotape with the VCR. And then we can, I think, just walk to the monitor. Hit record. Oh, we need to slow this down, so we need to change this to EP, and press stop. Oh, okay. It's recording? I thought the circle was a record, but never mind. Oh, to Fred Edison, internal revenue. Come with us. I'd like to go over uh, some of your records with you upstairs. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to switch to EP for a long play. We need to rewind back, I think, and then play. And what I'll do is I'll play very slowly. And the good thing is, is I don't have to remember the numbers. So it's 101, 999, and 57. We don't care about the IRS, so we can, um, I think just press escape. So we've got those numbers now. Um, I believe we just eject. And we can go all the way down the stairs now. And then just see if it's closed. Should be able to open it. Let's see, it's 101 57 And now we have the contract. The part of the first part shall hereby be known as a crazed maniacal genius. So we can pick that up. We've got the contract now. And then we can go upstairs. Say, so, what's the filing date for BFD 206ZZ Intervention Credit Applications Form? You have until midnight on the 12th working day past the first uh, full moon after the end of your fish, uh, fiscal year. Fiscal year. Fiscal year. However, you can extend the date by filing an RPM 78 warning interest extension anytime before the closure of business on the second Tuesday after the first Friday of March. And of course, if you're married, you'd also have to file a K7209 statement of joint intentions that declare any mutual gift expenditures. Oh, Jesus, I'm glad I'm not IRS. Yeah, that's right. Um, see if we can open a door. Hey, you can't go in there. All that red tape ought to keep me busy. 
we were on our way to get mail. Um, do I bother talking to... No, let's not talk to the IRS people yet. In fact, let's save just in case, because I know this machine... It's fine for a while, and then it'll crash because of the uh, 256K. Uh, oh, three. There we go. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go and try and help... Dr. Fred. By going into this window. Uh, pick up the rope. Alright, uh, talk to Dr. Fred. Dr. Fred must still be asleep. Okay, so what we need to do is we need to use this rope with the pulley. Uh, not this. We need to go with the pulley here. So we use rope with the pulley. We need to go back down again. Stolen, circular prints left behind. So, with it being in the present, the um, purple to to purple tentacle is causing trouble. Uh, we need to use the rope with Dick cousin Fred. Uh, Ted, sorry. Because one thing I realised on Friday after the stream was what it was to use there for. Uh, we can give that to Hoagie. And we'll switch to Hoagie at the moment. And then we'll go downstairs to Edison. Because one thing that... Um, um, here's a kite flyer. Franklin said was... Don't disturb me until I get something waterproof. Well, if we give, uh, use the help sign with Red Edison. Hmm, what's this? Help wanted. Morning drone. Morning drone. Hmm. Assist genius. Yada yada yada. Well, I'm the only genius around, and you don't, don't, uh, you look dumb enough. Um, so pick up your lab coat and get to work. Right, so we pick up the lab coat over here, which he uh, now lets us have. Looking at the lab coat, it looks more like a raincoat than a lab coat, which is good. That's the material we need for the uh, kite. So we give 
lab coat to Franklin. I got something good for you, mister. Uh, mister? Mr. Brainstorm? Yes, hand it over. Hmm. Doesn't this belong to somebody? Yeah, Red Edison. Ah. I'm sorry, but the man has no vision. A lightweight, durable fabric like this going to waste down in his basement. When I'm done with it, it will fly. Hmm. Eureka! The all season Francocopter. Yeah, ready to make history. Right, we've got to be quick now on this one later that day. There's no fuse. So, what do I do? Light? For the last time, you're not going to light anything. You just push it. The whole time? How am I going to get up that high? Listen, just wait for me to say the word now. Then push the kite into the air. Alright. I'm on your lasagna. Right, so we need to quickly um, use this with that. And then push to get ready. And there you go, done. She's handling kind of funny. You got it. Just hang on there. She's too heavy. I can't control her. Hang on, Ben, hang on. She's breaking up, she's breaking up. Run for your life. Now that was interesting. Yep. So can I see that kite for a second? No, I'm taking it back to my lab in Philly right now so I can study the results. Wish me luck. I never got your name. It's Hoagie, sir. Nice working with you, Hoagie. I promise to name an invention after you someday. Gosh, thanks. So we've now got the fully charged battery now. Which we just go straight over to here and get it used. Use this with the plug. And then we can save. Right, so that's that done. Let's go back to Bernard. What was the next thing I did? <coughs> I'm sure I tried to talk to the IRS people, but it didn't get me anywhere. Let me see if I can show the contract to this guy. As you can see, we're sort of busy. Mm. Okay, let's try and talk to them. What is it? Are you guys brothers? 
at the IRS for all brothers. What have you done with Dr. Fred? We've got him safely locked in the next room whilst we go over his books. No, you can't go in and see him. And don't even think about staging some kind of rescue. Who's your tailor? Very funny. I'll just be moseying along. Keep the nose clean, kid. I wonder whether I've still got that book. Can I give this to the, uh, the IRS? No. I would have thought that with it being the empty bank account, there's nothing really to go for. Well, I say that. It's a bit of a dumb idea, but... Now, I do remember something about a funnel and Red Edison using the coffee again. I didn't seem to be able to do that when I tried on Friday. Hey, Ted. Talkative as ever, eh, Ted? No point talking to Ted, you just get nothing. So if I try using the funnel with Dr. Fred, no time for fun now, I just gotta get him out of here. And I've tried using the bed. Not the bed, sorry, use rope with the bed. Can't do that. Use rope with Dr. Fred. Oh! Oh, that's why, because that's what he does. Okay. Hey, where'd he go? Ah, there you are. Just lie there and take it like a man. Mm, use... No, I don't want to do that. Use... Rope with door? No. Nope. Use rope with Ted? Nope. Use crowbar with bed. Generally, where I got stuck with um, Bernard. The other thing I need to do also is how to get the teeth from the horse. Conversation. Yeah, okay, that's nowhere near uh, what we need. Hmm. So, with this side, what we need is the teeth for this side, we need We've got the laughing, and we've got the hair. Let's see if we can win those two. I need to get rid of this guy so we can go into the basement. I 
And so I said to her, that's not my suction cup. Haha. -ha. You think that's funny? Listen to this. Doctor, what is it? Is someone sick? We can't have sick humans in this show. Well, um, I examined all them all myself. They're all perfectly healthy looking to me, except for the dead one. Now leave me alone. Talk to the judges. Right, so we can do two of these. When are you gonna do the best here? We'll do that one. Oh, all right. Wow, for a mummy, that's some great looking hair. Yes, it has a certain meatiness. And it does have stars and lightning bolts. Well, but does it have stars and lightning bolts? No, Harold is still the best. But if Harold were to, say, drop dead, I'd be the first to give it to the mummy. Agreed. Hmm. We've got to get rid of Harold somehow. Laugh. Okay, who's got a joke? Hey, I just flew in from Baltimore. And boy, are my cus uh, suction cups tired. Aha! A classic. I think our mummy friend has picked up a sense of humour somewhere. Yes, but Harold still tops him. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, of course, Harold wins hands down. But if it weren't for Harold, I'd let the mummy have it. Right, so we need to get rid of Harold now. How do we do it? I forgot about this. white and blue. There's our love coming back in again. Howdy Harold. Howdy I'm sure. Right so we can't say much to Harold. Contestant? Nope. Okay. See, the problem is, is I can't take the costume off now. Unless I've got to go up.
see the human show. I'm glad you're here. What kept you? Um, well, I hate to say it, sir, but there was some trouble with one of the humans. Trouble? What sort of trouble? Nothing I couldn't handle, but I've noticed something about the humans that may pose a problem. Do you continue? Well, sir, in general, they seem to be a bit larger than those tentacles. You know, taller, heftier, more massive. I get the picture, son. I don't mean to carry on, sir, it's just that it makes me feel inadequate, small, inferior. Before you go off the deep end, let me tell you why I called you here. You see, I've invented something which will end our troubles with those gr uh, glandular leg walkers for good. I've invented the diminutor. The what? It's a shrinking ray dot. Oh, I get it. Now I need you to get me a few parts so I can finish the thing. Come over here. Well that's going to happen anyway. That's saved. Impressive and power map, but at least tentacles recycle stuff. What can I? What can I recycle? Okay. It has three settings. Cook, jet, defrost, and mutilate beyond recognition. So that's the microwave. And I've got this weird thing here. It says opener. Remove specimen here. The label is hard to read, but I think it says something about a rhesus monkey. Laboon. 
because I'm wondering whether chewing gum will stop Harold from laughing. Sounds like a bizarre concept, but could work. Oh, wait a minute. I do need... Give bath to Laverne. Because I've just remembered that the doctor's there. And what did Laverne say? Someone, well, he's asking if somebody was sick. So if we use the bath, that'll get rid of Laverne. Uh, sorry, that'll get rid of Harold. Let's try the gum first. Oh, please. Why must you pester me? Fine. Use bath with Harold. Oh, Harold. That's gross. What are you babbling on about? You really should have told the judges. If you weren't feeling well. Oh, ick. How did that mess end there? I think I'm going to be sick. So when they're not feeling well. I was feeling fine until I saw that. <coughs> Is that your regurgitation? No, I'm a healthy human. Didn't you just say you thought you were going to be sick? That's just a figure of speech. You realise uh, you could have infected the whole show with human influenza. But I just got all my shots. You're a good looking human, Harold, but you know the rules. You're out of the show. What a mess. I hate cleaning up after humans. Right, so that's that one. Way. Right, so now we can go judge Besser again. seen on the mummy. Ah, well, I've seen this. Thick and full of juicy oh, It's a bit different. The mummy wins. Agreed. And then we can do best mind. Oh, no, that's going to be fail. Meant to do the laugh, but never mind. It's not going to cause us issues anyway. Not a bad set of chumpers on that blonde. If Harold's not competing, I don't care who wins. <sighs> Me either. Right, so let's do the correct one, the laugh. Okay, who's got a joke? I know, why did the human cross the road? Because his tentacle old him told him to. It's amazing how the mommy can do that without moving his lips. I say we give him first place. Agreed. 
Right, so we got first place in two things. We need the um smile. Uh, not smile, laugh. No. I was right the first time, the smile. So that's the teeth definitely. I just don't know what to do. Christmas lights. No oh, what keen Christmas lights. Can I pick them up? Okay. Welcome to Novelty Goods uh, welcome Novelty Goods Convention. Microwave. It's been mean. Use the hamster with the microwave. Nah. Fine. If it gets to a certain part of the stream, I'm probably gonna. Wait on. 
one hour, so we've been at this for just under an hour. Have I not picked something up? Maybe I got a little carried away. Sure. Pick up this. Bad enough to carry the weight of his death on my conscience. Speak to the cigar salesman. Hi there. What could I do for you, kid? Let's try the cigar one. No cigars. I import them from the finest Cuban mu uh, munitions factories. Now beat it, kid. told you look like Don Pardo. That's strange, my wife says I look like the, like the ghost pirate of Chuck. Now beat it, kid. So where is everybody? Really big bash was last night. I guess they're all sleeping it off. They'll get lost. That was the guy upstairs that we um, basically um, knocked off his bed. Put that down. Okay, so we can't. through because I'm stuck. Okay. Just to get me a little further. I mean I've done pretty well so far to be fair. I think this is not very um, linear because I've done things in a different order by the looks of things. Oh, right, okay. That's what you do. Give textbook to Hoagie. Use textbook with horse. Ahem. The, Lala, uh, the compiler was constructed by the following method. Lala, sorry. Um, first, develop a rigorous elective grammar. If the elements have NP complements, the Kuruki factor could be ignored. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah. Right, okay, so we can pick up the dentures. Give dentures to Laverne. Yep, just need a little push. Because I wasn't quite sure I've got the dentures. Use dentures with mommy. And then get the best smile done. Teeth. There's nothing like in the rules about being white. 
First place goes to the mummy. Agreed. Well, that makes him the best of the show. Let's go congratulate him. He is very well preserved. I'll miss his laugh. It's time to give uh, him his winnings and start packing up. We're going to get this whole show to Baltimore by Thursday. Yes, our work here is done. Well, Ted, this is where we part ways. You've certainly helped with sell to humanity. Even though you've been dead for thousands of years. I think you're my... Favourite Edison. Right. So we've got... Dinner for two at Club Tentacle. Dang, it says tentacles only. And then trophy. Ooh. It says it right. Okay, it's fine. I got the Robomatic Gizmo for you, sir. You mean the high frequency grab jizzastic generator? Yes, that one. But I'm having trouble locating the Nomo Watsits. The Numo Numo Electric D amplifier. You might try the old abandoned lab in the basement. It's hardly been touched in 200 years. Yes, sir. The Dimmy Neurator will be my crowning success. With it, I will be able to shrink the entire human race out of sight. <laughs> right, so that mean, might mean that the guard might have disappeared. Unlikely, though. So we saved. I know what to do. So we've now got the. Um, bear in mind, I'm only using. I've used the um, walkthrough once, so I've just remembered. So the talk we had with the um, the guard who was talking about going to Club Tentacle, we can do that. So we go and use. Certificate with guard. Whoa, dinner for two at Club Tentacle. Can't wait to tell my wife. Right, so now we can use the switch. You're free. Free to do what? Free to um to run wild through the woods like humans should. Big deal. I said you're free, now get off your fat lazy butts and start enjoying it. Enjoy being hunted for the rest of our lives by that moustached old tentacle with the big net. If you ran off, he'd be right on a trail. If we stay here, we'd, not be, we'd be warm and comfortable. Outside we'll be eating bugs and moss. You'll be eating my fist in a second. The woods are filled with wild animals. Lions, tigers, and skunks. Man, I hate skunks. And the good thing is, now that we've got the paint on the cat, we can just use the cat. Hey, look, a skunk. Oh, oh, 
Come back here, you monkey humans. You can't do this. This is an escape proof facility. And that's who says you can't learn anything from, from cartoons, eh, kitty? And that's them gone. Which means that the guard is gone. So we'll save again. And now we can go down here. I wonder if that still leads down to Dr. Fred's old lab. So this use suck appeared because we um, had the, it written in the constitution that the uh, vacuum cleaners will be in every uh, apartment, not apartment, any cellar. So that's that. Good riddance. That's the time machine ruins. Something else there I don't think. Oh, extension cord. So you use extension cord with outlet. Brill. Ah, uh, wait a minute. So I need to give hamster to Laverne. Oh, I can't put it in the chronogen. Hmm. Hatch. That's how you empty the vacuum cleaner, I guess. Open it. Nothing in there. Use back with hole. Vacuum up mice. Maybe later. Just the tentacles winter uh, winter things. So the same generator that was in Dr. Fred's lab. Or do I get Bernard to generate stuff up? Hmm. Let's see what's upstairs. Something to do with the ice box. Would I need to put the? Hang on a minute. Would I need to put the hamster in the ice box? Sorry to do this to you, little fella, but it's for the future of the whole planet. Yeah, I thought it was. And close that. And then give sweater to the 
you can open this. Um, okay, ice machine. Looks like there's some kind of robot down there. Cool. Uh, pick up frozen hamster. <laughs> Close that. Look at this. It's frozen solid. Right, so I'm gonna have to use a micro. Uh, the microwave to thaw him out, which I don't think he's going to be happy with, but, um... Oh no, that's the doctor. So, use hamster with microwave. <laughs> Oops. Gosh, I hope this isn't like the primitive, dangerous microwave ovens of my century. This thing's could really pop our hamster good. Uh oh. <laughs> Looks like a pissed off. <laughs> that was fun, but only because this is a 22nd century. See, kids? I hope pop ham uh, hamsters in microwave back where I'm from. Get taken away from their parents and pull for adoption. So don't do it. Right, it's cold wet hamster. Use hamster with hole. Uh, maybe not. Use sweater with hamster. Yep, that's fine. Oh, and then we go downstairs. Um, that's right. Use hamster wave generator. Suck a go. It just keeps running and running and running. That's Laverne's side done. Let's have a look at this. There's a face print on the glove. Hope it's sprung for good. Pick up glove? No. Use scalpel with this? Nope. Push that. Pull this? No. Hmm. Well, we've got the second generator going. As in, not the second generator, the second, um. Uh, the second time thing running and all I needed was just a little push and I got the rest of it I don't think I ever would have worked out the textbook on my own to be fair
No, there's nothing there, is there? He's ready, Lebone's ready. Someone needs a sign. And I also need to get the doctor rescued. I've got to use those two here somehow. Congratulations, Kitty. You save humanity with your repulsive appearance. Pick up the cat again? Busy with my Reagan, so please leave me alone. I don't think there's anything else I can do on Laverne's side. There's something with I'm gonna use decaf with never mix, never worry.
Try to use the funnel with these two. He doesn't like that idea. Funnel with Ted. No. Pull Ted. Pull Ted. Push Ted. Pick up Ted. No. Use Ted with Dr. Fred. Oh, I see. Hey! Who's this duck? Relative? Well, I'm sure we can audit him next. <laughs> this isn't a party. Shit. So I was probably close to doing something. to where's the red paint because of the bandages so if we put the red paint on Ted and swap the two of them right okay I get it now uh, who's got the red paint give this to Bernard use this with Ted should have thought about that Head with Dr. Fred. Hmm. Thought I heard something. Everything okay in there? Well, I'll try to keep it down, okay? Right, okay. Use root with Dr. Fred. Go outside and then pull again. Now, nah, I'm not going to make that mistake again. Fred, are you okay? Dr. Fred? I beg him to the lab. Well, I got him in here. But he's out cold. That's not a problem. Use funnel with Dr. Fred. And use regular with, doc with the funnel.
Damn good coffee. Right, okay, so I'm guessing I give contract to Dr. Fred. I've got a contract for you to sign, Doctor. Sorry, I don't like to sign things I haven't read. Okay, so read it first. I'm busy trying to think of a way to save humanity. I don't have time to read. Now leave me alone. Hmm. How do I use bankbook now? Give bankbook to Fred. Give contract to Fred. Will you please send this contract? I don't sign things I haven't read. But the whole human race is at risk. Of course, that's why I'm busy to think of a way to save it. I don't have time to read. Now leave me alone. Try it again. Maybe I've not done something correct. And try and sign it or get real mad. Do what? Not be my friend anymore. Ha! Huh. Okay, let's try one more. Let's try the last one. Okay, forget it. I'll get rid of purple tentacle myself. Oh yeah, how? Ah, here we go. Uh, I'm getting to purple tentacle declared and seen and arrested. I'm staring at uh, start a uh, petition to ban all tentacles. Offered purple tentacle a bribe, but he took it. I guess I can't. Hey, did you join the record club lately? Let's try the record club. Good God, no. Those things are horrible, money leeching death traps. Well, there's a delivery man upstairs with a carton of easily listing eight tracks for you. He says all you got. He says you have to pay for them. Ah, not again. Unless you sign this refusal form immediately. Thanks, that was a close one. Well, good luck. Real, so we've got it signed. Um, so I should be able to use the stamp with the envelope. Real, and then we can go upstairs and get that mailed. Tentacle rescues returns Emerald. May I congratulate the Purple Hero? Mm. Okay, so open this. Use sign contract with mailbox. Already missed the deadline. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I know how to do this. Give this to Hokey. Make 
as he's in the past. So, there's no way to miss the contract if you put it in that early. Yep, yeah, what do you want? Hi there. Is this Dr. Fred Edison? Who do you think called? Dr. Spock? Look, I don't have all day. This is Barley Crocker, LucasArts Games. I just discovered your contract among some very old files. And well, our lawyers say that we um, have to pay you two million dollars in back royalties uh, for the use of your family in the Maniac Mansion video game. What? This is Farley Crow. No, I heard that, you moron. When do I get my money? Oh, right now. It's been credited to your Swiss bank account. Operator? Get me a travel agent. This is an emergency. Right, so that's that done. Save stream three. Go back to Bernard. Uh, use and oh no, use phone. I don't have time for that. TV. This beautiful 4,000 carat diamond can be yours today. For a special rock bottom introductory pies of $2 million. The number to call is 1 800 Star Wars. Don't miss this amazing one in your lifetime opportunity. So use phone. Couch Potato Shopping Channel, Wanda speaking. Um, I want to buy a diamond. That would be two million dollars. Do you have a major credit card? Uh, I've got a numbered Swiss bank account. What's the number, sir? Um. It's 846-427-35327. Very good, sir. We'll send a diamond by pronto post light speed delivery immediately. Thank you for calling. Now that's a service. Better get to this to Dr. Fred right away. That should do it. Where did he get this diamond anyway? Um, it was donated by a group of Girl Scouts who were in the neighborhood. How heartwarming. According to my instruments, everything is in readiness. Your 
friends have activated their units, so it's time to throw the switch. Great. Hoagie, I'm so happy to. Hi, I learn. Wow. I'm so glad you two made it back okay. I hate to interrupt, but there's no time to lose. Now that you're back, you've got to proceed with the original plan to send you back to yesterday to turn off the sludge matic Uh... Say what? Now hold on a minute, Dr. Fred. I just barely made it back to our time alive, and I think... Ah, you can't turn off the machine if I get there first. Uh-oh. Don't worry, guys. This time I know I can stop him. Guess we better do something. Let's go. No, wait. You can't all go in the same stall. Didn't you see the fly? monster dudes. Great. Stuck here the rest of my life. Listening to Bernard talking and watching Hoagie eat. Mum warned me there's be days like this. Now wait just a minute. Oops. Mm -hmm. It's green tentacle. What was that green? He was trying to warn you about me. Oh. We're going to turn off the Sojomatic and defeat your evil plans, you little grown worm. You sorry lot are no match for me. But there's three of us. Well, sort of. Nevertheless, I mean to crush you. Yeah? You and what army? Why, this army, of course. You, shit. you see, I've been busy. These are all versions of myself in the future. I've been bringing them back here using the Chronogon. Together we will conquer the world. Turn there. Go to the basement and guard the Sojomatic. No one has touched the Sojomatic. Now, creature, I must decide what excruciating tortures to. Leave them to me. I've been itching out for a chance to test out the newly uh, completed Diminutor. Uh oh. Excuse me, uh, us. Ha! Gonna say. All right, the rest of you come with me. Sorry, with the um. Next stop, the world. Yeah, sorry, but there's slight um, Alan Partridge a uh, harder. What do we do now? Whoa, it wears off. Run for it. 
down. The battery must have not had time to recharge. But it will. Seeing that we don't want to have to redo again. Save that. What are we on? 20. Oh, I've got 30 minutes yet, I suppose. Okay, what have we got? Another television. That's right, an incredible 4,000 carat diamond. With a piddling sum of $2 million. That number again 1 800 Star Wars. Call him now. Call now. Tell him you just sent you. Hmm. Okay, just said that before. Use the phone. No. Close the door. Static phrase dynamo again. So if I just run past. Oh no, I can't run past. Right, it's about to go downstairs. Too small to just. Oh, I should be able to do it now. Okay. Can we go through here? Yes. Locked door. Pick that up. Yes. Real purple tentacle. We all are dopey. Were you paying attention earlier? Now buzz off. Now this 
Let's try giving out one in time to the purple tentacles. Bribery won't get you anywhere, okay. Could you let us pull that uh, lever over there? No tent. No buzz off. Hopping out to get some Chinese food. Nice try, but we're not budging. Yeah, buzz off. Look behind you, a three headed monkey. The only three headed monkey here is in front of us. <laughs> Now buzz off. Okay, try and talk to Dr. Fred. Dr. Fred, are you all right? Get me out of here. I feel like I'm pup eating. Let's see if there's... Use this with Dr. Fred. No. Use the help wanted to whack purple tentacle with. as well so I think the only thing to do is probably to use the bowling ball with tentacles since they look like ten pins machine prevent all this tentacle mayhem from ever happening.
Well, I'm certainly glad that's over with. Yeah, let's get out of here. Leaving so soon? We haven't had a chance to get together to know one another. Efforts are so tiny. Ha ha ha! Run all you like, uh, run all you like, you insignificant insect. The human race is doomed. Okay. I've already worn. Use this with this. Well, not. Use this with Dr. Fred. Nope. have against humans anyway. Humans are our oppressors. They made us live in this horrible motel. They created us in ungainly forms so we could not rise against them. <coughs> Try walking around with your legs tied together and glue your shoes. You'll see what I mean. But humans also created the Sojomatic, which made you super intelligent. Nonsense. I created that myself and sent it back through time. I knew Fred's mad scientist ego would make him use it. How's that for a paradox? Fred, but there's only one of them. Right. Anyway, you can see why I took the test humans. You're pretty handy with that raid gun. Sense with the forehead every time. Would you like a demonstration? You couldn't hit your own forehead. Nice try. Are you really a future version of Purple Tentacle? The Wells would be brilliant enough to invent the Dimulator. Less intelligent than the tentacle from our timeline. The same, but I've had 200 years to think things over. Uh, let's discuss your hatred of humans further. What's to talk about? I detest a whole cackling, hang ringing lot of you. Sounds like you just hate Dr. Fred. Hmm. I suppose you're right about that. I didn't start out hating all humans, just Dr. Fred. Why do you sent Fred with the rake on for a change? Oh, I just realised what's going to happen. Hmm. Perhaps that would be entertaining. Oh, crap. Um. Surely we could talk this out. Talk? 
surely. Wait. You haven't heard the last of me. I'll be back, and the next time, the world and its and all its piffing inhabitants shall be mine. All mine. All mine. Okay, little fella. Mail this to Siberia. So we've pretty much done this now, which is good. Well, kiddies, it's been more than it's been more fun than a jumpsuit full of weasels. Now, kind of get your freakish hide out of my home, please, Doctor Fred. You've got to get us out of this mess. You look terrible, and we can't buy clothes off the wreck. sort of used to it. Maybe we could go on a talk show circuit. Help us, Dr. Edison. You're the, our only hope. Oh, alright. Hmm. Exactly as the side show attraction you imagined. You're just three complete goofballs stuck in one suit of clothes. taken care of. Looks like everything's back to normal. The end. So we managed to do it within uh, three. It should have been only two, but I've had to um, I had to kind of rush on the second um, last week. No, no, was it like Friday it was last week, yeah. Give me a sec, hang on. So, yeah, I had to rush it and, um, um. Anyway, yeah, I had to rush it. Because I suddenly forgot to make the, um, the save, um, uh, so I had to speed on it on the second one, so I could have done it last Friday, actually, think about this. The good thing is, I only needed the, the, um, walkthrough twice, uh, for two small parts, the textbook part, and the, what was the other part that I used it for? Oh, uh, I couldn't work out how to properly rescue Edison after that pretty smooth sailing from there. Um, what we're gonna do now that we've done this. And then after the stream, I'll update the memory. I've been trying to do it before the stream, and uh, <laughs> it 
taken ages to do anything. I'm trying to think what I've got on here that would be... Well, watch the end of this and then I'm going to kind of do a be right back. I think that'll be an idea. Well, I'm, I'm, yeah, well, I need to do. Can I save it at this point? Yeah, I can actually. Right, I will just be a moment, so I'll be back in a, uh, in a sec.